Priest is in the New York ring as Ezra Charles of Cincinnati, Ohio, prepares to defend his World Heavyweight Championship against Lee Oma of Buffalo, New York. They come out for the first round. Lee Oma in the black trunks, Ezra Charles in the white. This is the sixth time since he won the title that Charles is putting it on the line. It's 15 rounds to go. Charles weighs 185 pounds. The challenger, Lee Oma, 193. Charles going right after Oma here in the opening minute of the first round. Now Charles begins to back off a little bit, wary of that straight left hand that Lee Oma has. The referee is Ruby Goldstein. Still more or less feeling each other out here in the opening round. Oma is 34 years old. He's had 16 years of prize fighting. At this stage in his career, this could be his last chance. Made Charles miss badly then. Charles is a beautifully conditioned athlete, well coordinated, very quick. Omar has a rather awkward style. He's a tough fighter to solve. He sometimes walks away from his opponent. He'll half turn his back and walk away. He hasn't done so yet. Now they come out for the third round. Ezra Charles in the white trunks has been having a little trouble trying to figure out Omer's peculiar style. While he's been the aggressor for the two previous rounds, he's still just a little bit puzzled by Omer's manner of fighting. Ezra Charles, the world's heavyweight champion in the white trunks. Lee Omer in the black, the challenger. Is it Charles going after Leoma now? Charles punches well with either hand. Good right cross by Ezra Charles. And another sends Leoma back. Charles warming up to his job now here in the third round. Ezra Charles' sixth title defense. Leoma looks just a little bit overweight, particularly around the hips, the kidneys. Notice the sag of excess weight, and he just took one that almost made him sag, did Leoma. Referee Ruby Goldstein separates the two men. They're both careful of the pace. It's a 15-rounder. Charles missing badly then, going off balance. Oma, however, too slow to take out after him. As the Charles seems almost disdainful of that left lead of Lee Omer's. And Omer misses that right cross. And now they come out for the sixth round, and the fifth round was taken away from Ezra Charles. Lee Omer in the black trunks, Ezra Charles in the white. Ten rounds still to go in this heavyweight title battle, and Omer, the challenger, seems to be showing the effects of weariness. And Ezra Charles remains the aggressor. Lee Omer, the 34-year-old veteran, a cagey prize fighter, he slips punches particularly well.
There's that walkaway technique of Alma. Begins to walk away from Mesut Charles, and he barrels right back in against Charles, and Charles fights back. We're in the sixth round of the 15-round heavyweight championship fight. Madison Square Garden. Left hand of Ezra Charles, particularly effective against Leoma. Charles has been shifting his attack from body to head and back to body again. That straight left to the head then by Ezra Charles. They're separated by Ruby Goldstein. Ezra Charles, the world's heavyweight champion. Looking fit, full of fight. And the challenger, Leoma, beginning to show the effects of weariness and perhaps the age, 34. He starts to walk away from Charles and Charles doesn't let him. Leoma now shows signs of arm weariness. He's keeping his guard very, very low. Let's see what Charles does about that. That's the end of the round. Come out for round nine. There's the Charles in the white trunks, Leoma in the black. Six rounds remain in this fight for the heavyweight crown. So far, it appears to have been Charles' fight virtually all the way. Charles won the seventh round, but the eighth round was taken away from Charles for a low blow. This is round nine. Leoma fighting back. Is it Charles, the aggressor, virtually all the way? As it Charles beating Leoma to the punch. Charles looks much the stronger now. Alma driving in, connects and then Charles holds on. A good brief flurry by Leoma. See if he can follow it up, he tries. Straight left hand by Alma. Alma has come back nicely in this ninth round. Lee Alma outweighs Ezra Charles by eight pounds. Ezra Charles keeps coming right after Lee Alma. Charles defending his world's heavyweight crown. Closing moments of this ninth round as the Charles comes back strongly. The tenth round of this 15 rounder, Leoma and the black trunks out of his corner. Charles pacing himself very well. He's ahead, definitely. The challenger has taken most of the punishment thus far, by far. As the Charles keeps hammering away at Leoma. Alma now being forced to hold on and referee Ruby Goldstein separates the two. A ter terrific right hand. Oma sent back. Charles going after him with another terrific right. Lee Oma seems to be in trouble. Charles keeps right after him. As it Charles with wicked lefts and rights. Another left hand. And another. And another. And Oma cannot seem to be able to defend himself. We switch to slow motion now to watch the drama. Oma seems to be on his way out. As it Charles going after him. Leoma game, but tiring badly, and he's a wide open target. A left to the stomach and a left to the head. Is it Charles throwing punches almost at random now? Almost defenseless is Leoma. 
still on his feet, still fighting back, holding on now. Trying to slow down, is it Charles? Another wicket left and another left. Homer goes reeling and it looks as though referee Gu Ruby Goldstein has stopped the fight. He has. Homer staggers dazedly to his corner, apparently surprised by the suddenness of the finish. Lee argues with the ring official, but he's clearly taken far too many smashes on the chin to be able to continue. Dr. Vincent Nardiello, New York's ringside physician, coming through the ropes to examine the fighter from Buffalo. Homer is declared to be okay. He just ran out of steam, he says. At 34 years of age, he just couldn't keep up the pace.